Before we go, Juan, I just wanted to say congratulations. The documentary that you are featured in, which is called Takeover, directed by Emma Francis Snyder, has just been shortlisted for Academy Award. Um, the documentary follows the 12 historic hours on July 14, 1970, when members of the Young Lords, which included Juan, at the time, took over the rundown Lincoln Hospital in the South Bronx. The Young Lords were the radical group founded by um, Puerto Ricans, modeled on the Black Panther Party in New York, co-founded by Juan Gonzalez, Democracy Now! co-host. Um, they drove out the administrative staff, barricaded the entrances of the hospital, made their cries for decent health care name known to the world. This is the trailer. Listen carefully and see if you can pick out Juan's voice. <laughs> is a story from New York, not the New York of Manhattan Broadway, but from perhaps the toughest square mile in the city, in the South Bronx. I was 14 years old when I joined the Young Lords. The Young Lords were a street gang that became politicized by the Black Panther Party. We became visible as servants of the people. One of our targets was Lincoln Hospital. That building was condemned 25 years ago. Condemned, condemned for rich people and opened up for poor people. It was a place that you went to to die. Lincoln was called the butcher shop. Blood stains on the walls, blood stains on the floors. And there was a rat in the emergency room. We have seen children get lead poisoning while hospitalized at Lincoln Hospital. So we felt now is the time for us to say exactly how we're going to respond to the killings of our people. Our plan was to take over Lincoln Hospital. We have to begin to stand up as the people, the Puerto Rican people, and say, that's enough, that's enough. We've been asking for changes to take place. And you've paid no attention to us. You've thrown us out of your offices. And you've called the cops on us. So now we're putting you out. You've taken over a hospital. We're going to run it. You're out. And I will walk you to your car. We immediately announced that we were not leaving until the city made a firm commitment to build a new hospital. From El Barrio to Arecibo, About a thousand policemen were en route with high-powered rifles. They had vans all over the place. If the police came in, it was going to be a bloodbath because the police hated the young boys. We were terrified. To all who had to hide, I say, to the people means, including people to gain control of their destiny. The Young Lords were ahead of our time in terms of recognizing that health care is a right. We wanted a revolutionary change to the health system in this country, and we still do. No oppressor is invincible. So that's the trailer for Takeover. Again, just shortlisted for an Academy Award. It's up for nomination. The judges are deciding now. Juan, we did a, um, a segment on this that encouraged people to go to. Um, but in these last minutes, we, in the last minute, we have your response uh, to this recognition. It's nominated in the documentary shorts category. Well, I mean, it's clearly great news. I'm still amazed that uh, there's been so much interest in what we did as youngsters uh, uh, more than 50 years ago. And uh, and I hope that some of the lessons of, of what we did right and what we did wrong will resonate with uh, younger people these days.